Okay guys, welcome back. So this week we are going to be working on the famous Mickey Mouse. He's um, quite fun and also very simple to draw since he's mainly circles and a hidden M inside his forehead area. So it's gonna be a fun one to do today. All you're gonna need, piece of paper, a pencil. I used a pencil um, to give my outlines um, because I always like to outline first before I put pen to the paper, but your choice, pen, pencil, crayons, go for it, have fun. And Mickey could be whatever color you want. Um, for this one, I'm gonna make him purple. So we'll be working on the center of your paper. Uh, you are gonna start off by doing, I like to call it a rainbow. I'm gonna make a rainbow. So half a circle or a rainbow. And what you wanna do when you've gotten that done is you are gonna to wanna to divide your rainbow in half with a pencil. So I'm going to make a line that goes straight down. And where my rainbow ends, I am going to make a line that goes across. So that is gonna give us some proportion or guidelines for Mickey's face where we're gonna put his eyes, his nose, and his mouth. So I'm done with that pencil. The next thing that I am going to do is I'm gonna put his nose in. His nose is going to go right underneath the cross line. And everyone knows his shape is an oval, a sideways oval, okay? So we now know where his nose is and in proportion to his nose are gonna be his eyes. And his eyes are gonna be on either side of this cross line that goes up and down. And the bottom of the eye is gonna go right on top of your uh, cross line this direction. So eyes are just going to be ovals. Okay, oval outlines. And he has a pupil on the inside, so his pupils are circles. Up next, we are going to do the ears. So ears are just circular shapes again. They're just going to be right on top. Okay. So there's one circle. We're going to attach it to the top of his head. Okay. Attach him to the top of your head. And you can kind of see he's coming together now. So we're going to continue working on the bottom half of Mickey now. So I want you to take your rainbow that you started and I want you to move it down just a little bit past this cross line here. Okay, it needs to come down just a little bit. That's finishing off the shape of his head. Because we're now going to go in and put in some cheeks. So the cheeks look something like this. Okay, it's a squiggle line, has a little bit of a lump, comes down to the bottom. Same for this side over here down to the bottom and the bottom is his chin right in through there so how's everyone doing hopefully you're getting a cool shape here um, we are now going to move into his mask area so his mask is the hidden M I was talking about and that's roughly gonna start right at the top right about here okay that's gonna be the widow's peak is what it's called um, you're going to make an M that comes down to your horizontal line, your cross line. So here's your other part of your M, comes down right to your cross line. Okay, so everything's kind of staying in proportion because of this cross that we made earlier. And we're going to continue making the mask of Mickey. So we're going to follow the shape of his smile. So his smile goes over this way. And don't worry, when you color everything in, it's going to come together. Um, last but not least, we have a smile to put in. So he's got a really contagious smile. Makes everybody laugh. So we got to make sure he's got those great laugh lines in there. And we are going to 
like a smiley face. Everyone's really good at that, I know. And we are gonna make his mouth open. So that's just an upside down a rainbow. And last but not least, in his mouth is his tongue. So everybody knows how to make an M. We're gonna make that M inside the tongue. And from this point, you're just gonna go in and you are going to color him. So let's give him. Now I promise you the coloring is really what makes your Mickey Mouse pop because he's majority colored in. See, we're getting there. It'd be fun if you want to make the whole Disney gang. But Mickey is my favorite. Hopefully my pen lasts. Nothing wrong with having multicolored Mickey Mouses either. You need to use other colors. Go for it. Biggest part are those ears. It's nice and colored. And there is a Mickey Mouse for you. And the very last thing that you can do I totally forgot. Thank you to my husband for reminding me. Mickey has an indentation above his nose and right under his eyes. Okay? So it shows a little bit more that his nose is 3D. So when you're done, you can go in and you can erase that cross that we put in, your guide. And you now have a Mickey.